Well, what do you throw a drowning bassist? His amp. <laughs> oh, hi. Sorry, I didn't see you there. You know, after a long day of making YouTube videos and replying to the comments thread, I treat myself to a dark ritual coffee. This is, excuse me, a damn fine cup of coffee. Dark ritual coffee roasters are based in the central district of Seattle, Washington. I'm currently enjoying the Honduras Beneficio San Marcos, roast level four, flavor, dark chocolate, walnut, and caramel. Come on, dark ritual coffee roasters. Tell them I sent you. Hey, hey, what is up YouTubers? Andrew Rooney here. I tell you, one of the most common questions I get is, you know, what do you like? Share something with us. So today I'm gonna share something I'm just so excited about. It's probably one of my favorite uh, bands at the moment. I, although I've only seen a limited number of videos uh, and seeing these guys in the past has just blown my mind. It's absolutely right in my wheelhouse of what I really dig. So it's going to be hopefully a treat for you. I'd love to hear your feedback. Hit me in the comments. Let me know what you think of my pick. It's Tim Akers and the Smoking Section fame. Guys, be sure to subscribe, like the video if you dig it. I know you're going to be blown away, so hop along to the Tim Akers original video link in the description of my video. And, you know, subscribe, get a load of what they're doing over there because it is just, it's pretty incredible. Let's check it out. Yep, yep. Fame makes a man take things over. Fame lets him loose, hard to swallow. I could watch this all day. Fame puts you down when things are hollow. Hawker. Too much to talk about here. Sounds like when everybody knows their role in a band. And can play their own. How's the BB? Monsters, absolute monsters. Every player off the charts good. This drum is pocket, I'm telling you. Don't get any better. I do not get any better than this. Aaron is playing. Oh man, a little bit of fame. Pocket. 
If you want to know what pocket is, that's pocket. What do they mean by pocket? That's what we mean. Take things over. Frame lets them loose. Hard to swallow. Frame puts you there where things are hollow. Band like this. It's like a jigsaw. It all just blocks. Oh, got double time. The drum. No placement on those kick drums. Everybody is a monster here. Monster. Like Zilda lifestyle. Different vibe, but same world class level. Woo! A lot of people ask, you know, what what do I listen to? And you know, if I share something back with the with the viewers, one of my picks, this is the kind of stuff that I just love. Now, the thing here is, yeah, they're playing a cover. They're playing, you know, they're reinterpreting David Bowie's song, Fame. And they've just put so many, they've just put their stamp on it. And what makes this so special for me, I mean, I've always had a real affinity for session players and the huge respect for session players. All my favorite drummers, uh, session players, past and present. I think the thing here, like a great sports team, it's knowing your role. No one's overplaying, no one's overplaying their hand or tr trying to stand out. Everyone's, you know, so musically mature and has so much vocab that they're just, everything's just so comfortable. And it's really hard. That was slow. I think that was even slower than the original tune. So they've slowed it down. And what happens when you slow funk down? It just gets really dirty and even funkier a lot of the time if you can sit in that pocket which is hard to do slow tempos are hard trust me and it's just the comfort it's the subdivisions there was a part where the drummer was inserting some extra subdivisions on the bass drum just just really ramping it up and they would the placement it's just undeniable the note placement of these type of players is just absolutely undeniable. They got their sounds dialed in. The bassist just blows my hair back every single time. <laughs> hey. And he is just, I mean, it's just so tasty. He can throw in a lot of chop and it, it doesn't matter because if you're in time and in tune, <laughs> you can get away with murder. And I mean, he's not playing heaps of stuff in that song, but it's just... Where he picks his shots is just so tasty. And there is something to be said for remembering the basics. As you progress in your journey on the instrument, I mean, think about those fundamentals. What, what have we got here? We've got a singer who sings in tune, which I don't want to pick on singers here, but I mean, it's often the singer is the, you know, especially live, just not pulling off numbers that they should be and i mean if the singer sucks that's it you're, you're done you're through already so we've got singer singing great singing his ass off in tune we've got bvs that are insanely well arranged and executed we've got an absolutely killer 
killer rhythm section that you can tell these guys play together a lot. They know what's going on. They're not <laughs> they're not phoning it in. They're just nailing their part. Not doing a lot more. They're just absolutely nailing their part. They're playing in time, in tune. I mean, I, I need to come back to this. I'm probably going to do a whole uh, drum teacher type video on playing in time because time is really misunderstood and a low priority for a lot of instruments. The great session players, like the guys in this band, I mean, you can hear it in the guitar. Well, in all of them, you can hear the time. But I mean, you listen to those guitarists, the bassists, keys, everyone's got heavy time. It's not just, I'll learn a, a bunch of shred and you know, the drummer will provide the time. No, they're committed to the time as well. That's when things start sounding really heavy and just dope because everybody's locked in. They're, they've got so much headroom. They're not, they're not pushed to their max. So yeah, I, I am, as you can probably tell, I'm hyped up on coffee. I'm just so excited about this band. And I, this popped up on my feed the other day and I just was, as I say, was just so excited. And it's just absolutely killer. One of my favorite acts going around at the moment, without a doubt. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed my pick. As I said, please be sure to subscribe and like the video and hop along to the link to Tim Akers uh, in the description of my video, hop along, subscribe, like, give them some love as well. Until next time, ciao.